Happy Halloween! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina and in today's video we're going to be looking at some Halloween vocabulary. I hope that you enjoy it and let's begin. Ghost. Ghost. They say the young girl's ghost still haunts the house. Witch. Witch. The wicked witch used sweet treats to lure the children into her house. Werewolf. Werewolf. On a typical day, Henry is just your regular stay-at-home dad. However, when there is a full moon, some say he turns into a werewolf. Jack-o-lantern. Jack-o-lantern. The children got pumpkins to carve into spooky jack-o-lanterns and lit candles inside of them. Zombie. Zombie. It was Halloween night, so we had decided to take a stroll through the cemetery. As we were walking, we heard a loud moan coming from behind us. We turned around and saw a hand emerge from a grave. I rubbed my eyes in disbelief. It was a zombie. Vampire, vampire. I am a vampire and I'm here to drink your blood. Fangs, fangs. The mysterious shadow moved quickly across the room. As it came closer, the shadow came to life. Its fangs pierced Elena's throat, and in that moment, everything finally made sense. It was indeed a vampire who had been watching her all those nights. Coffin, coffin. This may sound a bit crazy, but I could have sworn I heard a noise coming from the coffin. Mummy, mummy. What do you mean you saw it move? The Egyptian mummy is wrapped in bandages and is lying in its coffin. It can't go very far. Trick or treat, trick or treat. As the door opened, the children shouted trick or treat and the happy parents filled their bags with delicious Halloween treats. Monster, monster. The boy was certain there was something under the bed. Could it be a monster or was it simply his imagination? Skeleton, skeleton. Anna hung a creepy plastic skeleton on her window to scare the trick-or-treaters. Skull, skull. As we sat at the dinner table, I noticed a creepy skull in front of me. It really gave me the chills. Christina wasn't kidding when she said she went all out on the Halloween decorations this year. Tombstone, tombstone. It was a cold October night and Ben decided to take a walk through the cemetery. As he was looking at all the different tombstones, he noticed something that left him speechless and sent chills down his spine. He couldn't believe his eyes. There, in front of him, was a tombstone with his name on it. Cemetery. Cemetery. Some say his body is buried in the cemetery, but others say he's still alive, roaming the streets at night. Bat. Bat. The bat emerged from the darkness, ready to hunt for its first meal. Broomstick. Broomstick. On a clear, starry night, you can see the witches flying on their broomsticks. Spell. Spell. The wicked witch cast a magic spell on the prince, which made him turn into a frog. Sweets. Candy. Sweets. Candy. 
the evil witch wanted to fatten up the children to later eat them, so she fed them plenty of sweets or candy. Pumpkin, pumpkin. Let's carve pumpkins, watch scary movies, and eat pumpkin pie tonight. Devil, devil. This year, I'm dressing up as a devil for Halloween. All I need is some red lipstick, some horns, and a red outfit. Cheap and stylish. Cauldron. Cauldron. The witches then added the toe of a frog, the eyes of a newt, and the wool of a bat to their cauldron to boil. Spider. Spider. People ask me all the time why I'm so afraid of spiders. I mean, look at them. Need to say more. Spiderweb. Spiderweb. Have you heard the story of those kids that went into the forest at night? They say they walked into a giant spiderweb, got stuck, and an enormous spider ate them. Supposedly, you can still hear the screams at night. Haunted house. Haunted house. Sam agreed to go to the haunted house with his friends. However, upon entering, he quickly regretted that decision. Costume. Costume. Many people like to dress up in costumes and go to parties on Halloween night. Mask. Mask. This year's Halloween party was like no other. It was a masquerade party and everyone was dressed elegantly wearing gorgeous, intricate masks. Moonlight. Moonlight. The three witches danced in the moonlight. All right, students, we are finished today's lesson. I hope that you enjoyed this very special video and that you had a lot of fun today learning some new Halloween vocabulary. As you can see, I am very devoted and in love with this holiday. It's my favorite time of the year, and I hope that you were able to enjoy it with me or at least learn a few new words. I will see you next week, but don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for future videos. Mwah! Bye for now.